identify your network requirements. In this video, you will learn what's the Getting a Startup Guide and how to identify the network requirements for your WebEx services. In the overview landing page on a newly created control hub, please locate the section Getting a Startup Guide, which is the coaching feature that guides you in this initial setup. In there, you will find steps and the order in which it is recommended to configure Control Hub foundational services. First step is network configurations. Click on the steps to access the main article, and at the bottom, you can find other resources. The main article will take you to network requirements for WebEx services, which is the starting point. Make sure you already identified the type of WebEx services that you are going to deploy, the type of devices involved, for instance, WebEx app and or devices, type of traffic and protocols. That's going to make easier the identification of ports and URLs to uh, get open or whitelisted in your proxies and firewalls. You will find in help.webex.com the specific resources for each WebEx service. For example, if you're going to activate and deploy web installing, then port reference information alt article will be your ally. Or if you are deploying WebEx meetings, then this article will be your friend. And the same logic applies for other services. Let's say enabling Cloud Connected UC or dedicated instance. You look for what you need in Help Center and review the resource. That has been all. Thank you for watching.